considering we're taking a look at why they are what is it that they are gossiping about you tarot angels spirits and guides and sisters what are they gossiping about cancerian first card your business your money your success your independence how you look how happy you are how successful you look how confident how connected to the spiritual realms you are who you are people want to know who you are what it is that you are about they want to know what keeps you going, what you are, what you are doing that um, other that they are not doing. They people see you looking healthy, happy, confident, independent, self-sufficient, busy. Um, that's what they're gossiping about. You like, what are you doing? Maybe for money, for work. They're also like wondering who is interested in your life, which man or woman is around you. It's mostly about your money and your beauty, your health, your youth, your lifestyle. So let's see what they're gossiping about your lifestyle. They want to know like who is surrounding you, guiding you, protecting you, who your friends are, who your colleagues are, who you're working with, what kind of organization are you in because they think people, just people feeling like you look healthy, well, and blessed, guided, and protected, and they want to know, like, what connections you have. They even want to know, like, what school you went to, how you got your gifts, how you got your money, stuff like that. How you did something that you did, how you stay beautiful, healthy, wealthy. They want to know how you get so much attention, how, how you attract people to you naturally, how you get things easily like people just be like they think you are strong with the strength card you're in your courage your power your boldness your confidence like people are impressed by you inspired by you like you are a leader you are a positive influence you're so impressive people want to know like what it is that you have going on and in your like what is filling your cup what is restoring you Yeah, they want to know what is what kind of a protection you are using. This is what they're gossiping about you. They just um, they they're trying to talk about you, but it is like they're really curious about what's going on in your life, but they don't really know anything. They they just people think you're blessed and you're fortunate, you're gifted, you're guided, you're protected. It seems like you multiply money or you multiply good things and good things increase and prosper in your life. They want to know how you have certain boundaries, certain standards, how you cut certain people off. I think this is turning to what they want to know or what they're thinking. Like um, you cut certain people off of, out of your life. I'm cooking. So they want to know what's keeping you happy and confident and glowing and healthy. People want to come in and ask you like, is it your man? Is it your business? What's going on with you? Look, they want to know these surprises and abundant energies that surround you. Good luck and fortune and prosperity and health. They want to know where you got it from. People are really like positively inspired by you. People love you. People look up to you like health, like you're healthy and you're bright, you're successful and you're full of love. They want to know how you get so much love in you. So much understanding, so much knowledge, so much power. So let's see what else. So let's see who they're gossiping with. They could be gossiping to um, their friends, to the, their community, like people talking about you. Who are they gossiping to? They're probably f like trying to go talk to people that you work with before. Your exes, your family members. What are, what are you doing? You're, and you're so loving people just want to know like how come you're so loving and so happy and so beautiful even if you're single people want to know how you're so loving how people love you so much people like even if you're single they think that like you're single but people st like men if you're a single woman if you're a single woman men still love you like naturally beautifully really and like respect you and if you're a man, woman, love you, like, you just go out, get on good with some women, you know? So they're wondering how you do these things, how you have some good relationships. 
and they're wondering how if you have hidden enemies and how you get over your enemies and your stresses that's what they're gossiping about you they're even talking about your money too mm. oracle cards what are they gossiping about cancer they just want to know how you remain self-sufficient and they're watching your perseverance they want to know how you keep going on like because they're like everyone is everyone is going through something in life but you you're not that you're not going through anything but they just want to know how it is that you're managing to persevere so people are watching you like you may be winning you may be like doing you may be ahead of your challenges or your obstacles right now and so people are really like watching how you're pulling some things off some of them are watching to see if you will be able to pull these things off in your life and they're gossiping so let's see what else are they gossiping about cancer that cancer needs to know grief they're gossiping about some things from your past how you let go off of certain things how you overcame um people are this this is mostly what they're talking about some past energies of grief and how you overcame some feelings of loss and they know that you lost something but maybe this is like a loved one or something but they're saying how you're making it making that maybe that is why they're really impressed by you for some of you it is like they're impressed in another sense they're like just one in wonderment of what you have going on here and i for the most part it is about your natural gifts your beauty your abilities you like you remain natural and genuine and real down to earth if some people want to learn from you give me one more card what are they gossiping about you oh my gosh complacency they may be saying you're lazy or you don't do much or things just come to you but they're they're just because these people are, are watching you so it may be in another reading we're going to take a look at who specifically is watching you look gossip card and forgiveness so there were people that were gossiping about you like from a distance I feel like now they want to come into your life. They want to get close to you. They want to work with you. These people were standoffish at first. Because they, they were judging you. This vanity card in the reversal. These people were judging you for some reason. In some way for something. Like they had some mis, um, misperception of you. But now I feel like their mind is changing. And because they see you succeeding they maybe they thought that they didn't believe in you now they see you pulling something off and i feel like they're all gossiping about like how to approach you if you are approachable how to talk how to ask you this you know because they're really just really interested in your life and they want to come in and ask you how to do things but i feel like right now you put in a lot of work and you're focusing on manifesting more you have a lot of work to do you've healed a lot in yourself and you overcome a lot so yeah you've been on a journey of self-discovery so yeah cancer thanks for tuning in and i'll see you in the next one toodles